from Austin. And I'm Emily. We are playing from Gardner Road Elementary School. The average American throws out 4.3 pounds of garbage a day. That's 15,695 pounds of garbage a year. We're going to interview what other people will do to recycle. That's right, so let's go to Mr. Patterson's office and Ms. Claus's room. What do you do to recycle? I do a lot of things to recycle. Uh, at my home, I uh, have a recycling bin in my kitchen where I put all my recycling in. Um, I'm lucky where I live. It's single stream recycling. So it can all go in one bin and then uh, we take it to the recycling center and drop it off. There's also um, a place in Horsets called React and they take electronics. So I've recycled TVs and computers and all that type of stuff. And then in our school, we've also had recycling drives, like a paper drive to recycle paper. Okay. What can others do to help them? I think what others can do to help is be thinking about where they are going to recycle in their home. It's a really simple thing that you can do um, to make sure that you clean out the cans and put them in the recycling bin. I think there's uh, another thing that you can think about is upcycling, is how can you use old materials in new ways. So that's always really exciting. Like toys? Well, yeah. So maybe you can take old containers and um, items from your home, and then you can make items out of them. You can make art out of it. You can turn uh, old pieces of wood into a bookshelf or something like that. Okay. All right. Thanks, Charles. You're welcome. Are materials recyclable? Absolutely, Charles. So many materials are recyclable in the art room. We have our blue recyclable bin that we use every class. Not only do we recycle our scrap papers, but we also pull things out of the recyclable bin to use for projects that we make in the art room. Uh, for example, second graders recycled water bottles to make insect habitats for an art project they were doing. Any of the paper that we use in the art room, construction colored paper or white paper, is made from recyclable materials. Okay, Ms. Palmer, thank you for your time. All right, now that we know what others would do, Let's go try one of Mr. Patterson's ideas. We're going to put a recycling bin in the kitchen and in the morning, and at the end of the day, we're going to see how much they recycle. That was one of Mr. Patterson's ideas that he gave about recycling. Let's go do that.